Well, the guys were looking at a lot of different things, and um, the way it goes when designing a game is you draw a lot of characters. You you draw a lot, and and at some point, one of the guys, one of the designers, drew a bird that didn't have any wings and didn't have any legs. So, the guys were, why why doesn't it have wings? Why doesn't it have legs? And and why is it looking so angry? So when you can create stories, or when there are questions about something, then that's when you can build stories that answers these questions. So that's how it all started. Well, I don't know. You've got to, you know, watch out and, and see what's going to happen. Right now, the guys are going to be launching the Facebook game on 14th of February, uh, which is already quite good. And then I'm sure there's a lot of things that are going to come. I guess they were there at the right time, at the right place, and, and with the right experience. Um, it's not only about making a game that's engaging, but it's also making a game that's simple, making a game that's, um, that uses the technology the best, and also plugging in at the right time in, in the ecosystem. It was when the iPhone was starting to get big in Europe, um, and, and there were still a lot of things to be done. Now things are a lot different, and it, you know, the recipe for success is, is pretty much give it a shot, try and fail, and then try again until you succeed. Well, because ultimately, if you don't do things, if you only have them in your head, well, you're not going to see what's the result going to be. So you need you need to do things in order to learn from them. It's not you're not going to learn bicycling by just watching videos of bicycling. You're going to have to get on a bicycle and try it, and you're going to fall a couple of times. But then ultimately, you'll be able to cycle, and you can cycle 400 kilometers in a day. Well, fail as early as possible, try again, and make things happen.